Bummer. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. I am Trainer Havoc, and we're gonna take a week off of my normal things that I would normally do between Cosmic Eclipse and Hidden Fates, and I've been sitting on this Unbroken Bonds booster box for a while, um, and I want to open it. I, I, it was like a month ago or something. Sorry about maybe two. Or I was talking about I have the fever for this, and I, I still do, and I haven't been opening them. So I'm just gonna take a week and. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, instead of normally the uh, um, mystery box and stuff like that. I'm just gonna open um, each of these and then we'll have a special uh, pack battle Saturday with my brother. So, let's bust into this guy. I'm really excited about this. Um, we want a uh, trainer red, red's challenge, that's what we want. Um, is that what that looks like? No, it's not. There we go. That's right. I was like, this isn't right. It's supposed to look better than that. Did I get a pack in there? All right. All right. There we go. Ooh, I like that. There you go. Nice and fit. So we're going to go, we're going to do it differently. We're going to do uh, one, two, three. One, two, three. We're going to do 12. Let's go three in the back. Three in the back. And this will be our first episode right here. Oh, we got two enchants right there. That's kind of cool. All right, 12 packs, I'm excited. Opening 12 packs is always fun. It feels good in your hands. Let's get into Unbroken Bonds. I have no idea. The pull rate's always been really like hard for this one, so I have really no idea what um, what to expect. I also, it's been so long, I also don't know the, uh, like I know there was a, a batch difference, like they made two batches. Um, my guess is the second batch. This is so late into the game, but it's been so long, I don't remember how to even tell. I know it's like something to do with the code card, but I don't remember which way is which way. It's also been so long that as I'm looking at these cards, as I'm pulling on Giovanni and Rhydon, um, I remember that one. I don't remember most of these cards. We got a Reverse Meow and a Hypno Regular Rare. I also know that in this particular um, set, there's no like Prism or anything in the Reverse spot except for a Reverse, so. Okay, so I think, I think it's like this. Right. Yep, so, uh, yeah, so um, we've hit the third week of December. That's what this means. So, uh, yeah, guys, um, I'm getting all ramped up for uh, the Hanukkah week. Eight, it's eight days. Eight days of the Hanukkah opening of Hidden Fates. Um, Festival of Lights, whatever you want to call it. I think that would be a fun one to do. Reverse Hollow Slowpoke. And a uh, holographic crowbat, which is actually one I want. Um, I haven't actually pulled this one at all, and I, I haven't seen it as much as I'd like. But I'm really excited about that. I don't have sleeves with me right here. Yes, I do. They're just they're just under my legs. Um, I also had a had to do um, some work. If uh, you guys follow me on Instagram, I uh, uh, I got the last hidden taste uh, box for the. Oh, let's plug this in. Uh, Hanukkah. And then we got the Christmas special and the Christmas special. Is in oh we saw it screen. The Christmas special is in fact opening one of each hidden fates like uh, uh, box, each hidden fates like piece of thing they made, merchandise they made. Um, so that's gonna be exciting. Um, and I have one of everything. I had I got the hidden fates uh, uh, ultra premium collection in the box mail. Um, and it was trashed. The, the, there's a figure in there, broken to like four pieces. So I actually opened it three ahead of time. Um, it was missing the Rayquaza card in there, so I had to I had to go in and I had to um, I had to find that, uh, which it was in there, and I didn't look beat up, but I didn't look at it too much. I wanted to see as little as possible, uh, but. Uh, I had to, so it's, it's, it's pretty opened. Um, I'm gluing it back together. The figure is, um, looks good now. I took a picture of it. I'm gluing the box back together. So it'll be pre-opened, but I haven't opened anything in it. I haven't looked at anything. So uh, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. We got a reverse Rhyhorn here. Wow, I love that Rhyhorn. Drinking out of the creek. That is excellent. We got a Charizard and Rushy Ram GX, a card I do not have. I have not fathom pulling the, even this normal GX and I just did it. Oh, that is super exciting. That is a good looking card. Um, there we go. Uh, and I'm using the Unbroken Bond sleeves. <laughs> there you go. Look at that. That is a great looking card right there. Oh, that's so exciting. Um, 
More GXs to go. That's a great thing about booster boxes. Uh, I always thought, I don't want to spend that much. And I really don't want to spend that much when I when I buy these, but... Uh, it's just, it's, because, uh, okay, so when I look at it, I'm, a, I'm kind of a pessimist in my life. Uh, I look at it, and I'm like, I know I'm going to get all those green cards instead of looking at all the cards I am going to get guaranteed. But, I mean, I'm just gambling either way. I guess what it's kind of what it is, is uh, no matter what you get, you're going to, you're, you, you can delude yourself on the poll rates of anything. And the reality is that you might not get anything anyways. And, it feels really good when you do get something, which is why you, you know, you continue to go for it. But, uh, you're not promised that. Uh, we open up, uh, an Elite Trainer box, um, Cosmic Eclipse Elite Trainer box, and it was nothing, nothing worth anything in there. So, it happens, it happens. Um, so, booster boxes are exciting, especially after you start collecting, like, really heavily, like, a, you just know you have all, many, all these packs to open. You know opening packs is a good time because you never know what you're going to get. Um, but you also know that somewhere in there, there's a pack with gold in it. Um, we are over halfway, by the way, in this video. Um, busted into the second stack here. So far, we've only got one ultra rare, one hollow rare. Um, you know, that's, that's okay, though. The ultra rare was fire. You know, I don't know. I think I totally just messed this up. Um, uh, surprise box was Gengar. That's right. I forgot about that guy. Weeping Bell. That's incredible. Weeping Bell. Fire Crystal. There's our Glam Meow. Okay, we're dumping into it. Oh, our Victory Bell. That goes well with that Weeping Bell. Rhyhorn. Squirtle. I love that Squirtle. It came in that Blastoise and I got the holographic of it. And I love that card. I love Blastoise. Um, I'm going to push these to the side here. Yeah, so you, you just know when you get the booster box, you're like, you know there's a... Uh, there's a packs in here that you won't disappoint you and that's what you uh look excited for and i feel that now i get it i understand and here i am opening this is my third one i actually haven't even uh, finished the cosmic eclipse one my second cosmic eclipse one so i'll this will be the the second one i actually finish but the third one i open so yep all right we got a dusk stone here we got giovanni's exile we got that greninja Reverse Hollow. I think I've only got this in Reverse Hollow, and I think this is supposed to be a holographic. And we got Stunfisk. All right. Stunfisk is the far fetch of, you know, this, this set. Speedo. All right. I'm feeling something good in this. I don't know about you guys, but I'm feeling something good. I just think it's time. We got three packs left to open after this. One, two, three, four. Oh, I just brushed my fingers against it. It's good. It's good. All right. We got a Spiro. We got a Venonat. We got a Lickitung, we got a Spritzy, we got a Poliwag, I love that Poliwag just hiding in the in the pond there. We got a Leaf Energy, we got a Chatot, we got a Hitmontop, which I love and he's not on his head, which is weird. Uh, we got a Graveler, we got a Froakie Reverse, and then we got a Lucario and Mel Metal. I think I've got quite a few of these now, at least three, maybe four. Um, and you know what, that's okay, it is a great card. I'm not. It must be because I just showered. Um, I have a hard time opening the sleeves. That is a great looking card. That's another mascot of the set as well. Actually, why am I not? You boys. I need to go back here to display. I almost put it in there. There we go. Three more packs. This is probably my favorite pack. We'll, are, uh, we'll go like this. We got a lot of Machamps to look at, so we might as well just go. Ooh, Ooh that pack. That was, felt really sturdy. I like that. Okay. One, two, three, four. Or that fourth card, it keeps hiding from me. I think that's two right there. I feel like I'm messing up the card trick a lot. I'm not actually messing it up. I mess it up once, like big time, but I don't like that bad. All right, Ratata, Electric Energy, Welder. I love a full art Welder, but we still want Red's Challenge. That's the one we're looking for. I think Welder might be the only one I don't have, actually. Raichu, never give up. I think uh, the Welder might be the only full art I don't have. Because I have Koga and the other other one. Maybe, maybe there's more. But I do have Red's Challenge. I just want a better Red's Challenge. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two. When you start making these videos, you start thinking out loud. That's exactly what I'm doing. That's why I count out loud. I don't need to be counting out loud. I, I know how to count in my head. I just like, it's not what you do. It's not what you do. Before we go on to Samson Oak. Lieutenant Surge's strategy, which I feel like is in Hidden Fate, so we see a lot of that. Maybe I'm wrong, but 
Uh, Aaron Reverse Hollow, I love that. And in a Lowland Dunk Trio. Oh, I've been burying my uh, last pack. So here we go. This is my uh, favorite artwork, the Gardevoir. I love Gardevoir, man. Gardevoir is so good. It's like, like I always sat there when I played Ruby and Sapphire, and um, I always made sure I got a Ralts, and I always have it on my team. I think when I got Alpha Sapphire, which I've never beaten, but it's probably the furthest I've been in a while. Um, uh, Gardevoir is part of my team. There's Meltan. So yeah, let's hope we get something good in this last pack. Rhyhorn, and it's okay if we don't, because later this week we'll open up the rest. Fire Energy. Charge Above, Energy Spinner, Tor Cat, Reverse Hollow Ratata, and a Holographic Malmar. So we ended on a Hollow. Um, two Hollows, two Ultra Rares. There we go, right back there. That just means that we've got more to open up. I'm excited. Guys, if you're ready to see this Unbroken Bomb Week, please like, please subscribe so that you can see I have videos come out Wednesday and Friday and then I'm gonna have one Saturday that's a pack battle with two elite trainer boxes. So that should be good. I'll be 16 packs, so that'll be more. Um, but, uh, uh, you know, it, it will in fact be more. Uh, it'll be great. But it's, who knows? All right, well, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.